How long has it been since you've been on Elm Street? Don't let them put you to sleep. Welcome to a brand new nightmare. <gasps> now no one sleeps! Ah! I knew you'd be back. A Nightmare on Elm Street, part four. The Dream Master. How oh, sweet. Fresh me. Rated R. <laughs> now playing at a theater near you. Oh, Freddy Krueger, ghoulish pal of mine. Freddy? Oh, look. Refreshments. Entertainment. <laughs> well, you might say that the, the star of Nightmare on Elm Street, part four of The Dream Master, is a vicious, vile killer who lures young people to their death in their sleep. But you can't say he's not a gracious host. Mmm, even some coffee. Or whatever. Ah. dead <laughs> oh that should keep him out for a while are you feeling tired yet well you better pop open your eyelids with toothpicks because kevin isn't the only one i'm watching this one should keep you up <laughs> seems to be having a bad dream. There, there, sleeping beauty. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs>
Oh. I get it. It was a nightmare. <laughs> How apropos. Well, maybe if I could meet this Freddy character, I wouldn't have dreams about him, huh? A little tet a tet. Freddy! Freddy? Don't touch that dial as if you could. Kevin's nightmare is just beginning. <laughs> became such a big star well he dresses terribly he doesn't even have a good side that manicure of his you know <laughs> great for cocktail parties I suppose you know I don't want to be cruel about this but he has a terrible skin condition how does he do it? Well, this is what I've heard. He stays in touch with all the big studio heads. <laughs> this could turn into be quite a, quite a career move for me if I just play my cards right. And the opening ante is just finding the man. Fred, have you been to lunch yet? <laughs> Mr. Kruger, I'm a great fan of yours. special work to do here, you and me. You've got the body. I've got the brain. It's Kevin Seal, a Sal there. Plockman, Maury Amsterdam's old agent. You know, I pride myself on being a team player. You know, I like to pass the ball as well as run with it. There's a lot of give and take involved in show business, I know. But I feel I've been pushed and pushed on this one a little bit too far. First he doesn't show up, then he starts abusing me. He always smells bad. H Hello, Sal? <laughs> Sal? What? Oh, what's the matter, Kev? Sal put you on hold? <laughs> Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, relax, kid. I was just having a little fun with you. <laughs> I know you like my Nightmare on Elm Street movies. <laughs> oh, well, thanks, Freddy. I was that's, never really... Uh, that's Mr. Kruger to you. Oh, yes, Mr. Kruger. So, what about your new movie, Nightmare on Elm Street Part 4, The Dream Master? Is it as scary as all the others, I'll Mr. Kruger? i uh, <laughs> I'll let you judge for yourself. Like that hurt. Well, that's a qu quite a splashy, high production kind of thing you've got there. That's quite a quite a movie, and you're very professional. And I, I just have to say, I, I'm I'm quite impressed. I, I really am. What do you do when you're not working in the movies? I uh, have a job out in the community with uh, young children. Uh, you know, I I'm just so impressed. I misjudge you, Mr. Kruger. You're really, I'd say, one of the leading lights of our society. Today. It's small wonder to me that so many young people in the world go and see your movies and really enjoy 